Now next one is also very beautiful. We are going to do it. It's easy, brother. At-talibu zahaba ilal mat'ami. What kind of a sentence is this? Jumla ismiya. What is it? Jumla ismiya. You know how did it start? Uh, now, brother uh, Salman, you tell me. Where is the khabar of the mubtada? Jumla failure, mashallah, mashallah. What is? Where is the fail? Zahaba, brother. Where is the file? If there is a fail, there is a file. Where is the file? No, brother. No. Remember, I told you the sequence of Jumla failure. Fail, file. Mustatir, brother. You cannot say Talib is file. No. That is Muftada. File has to come after the fail. And if it is not there, then it is Mustatir. Takadiruhu huwa. Now you can say that huwa goes to Talib. Where does huwa go to? Talib. So if I literally translate it, uh, the student, he went to, to the matam. He went to the restaurant. Do you see me? How I said it? The student, he went to the matam. Because Zahaba, file has to come after Zahaba. But you will not translate like this in English. You will still say the student went to the restaurant. Eh? But if you were to literally translate it, then you will say the student, he went to the. Hmm? Okay. So here, Jumla failure came as a khabar. Fine, brother. Now you do at Tullabu. What is Tullabu? Muftada. Now, what will you say? Zahabu. Huh? Where is the file for Zahabu, brother Abdul Samad? Al Wow. Huh? Are you with me? Sisters, are you with me, inshallah? This is not difficult. Huh? It's, it's quite simple because you have, been, you have been practicing those verbs for the past few days. It should not confuse you. Okay? Now, uh, Sister Faiza. A talibu jalasa fil fasli. Translate, sister. Sat in the class. Yeah, class, fine. So, what is a talibu here? Mubta. Where is the khabar? Jumla failure. Huh? Are you with me? Jumla failure. Yes. See, I'm, I'm trying these things to make you very strong, inshallah. So that these things slowly, slowly, they take root in your mind, inshallah. Now change a talibu into tullab. What will you say? Tullabu. Uh huh. Jala. Jala. See, tullabu is now plural. What will you say? Jalasa. What is for plural? Jalasa, jalasa, jalasu. Fill firstly. Huh? So where is jalasu? Where is the file in jalasu? Wow, fine. Uh, Sister Amana, you think you can do it on your own or do you want to pass? Sister Fatima, you can do it. No consultation. Al Mudarisu Kharaja min al Madrasati. The Mudaris, he left from the school. So change al Mudaris into plural. Al Mudari Suna. Are you with me? Al Mudari Suna. Now Kharaja will become Kharaju. That's all doctor is trying to explain us. From singular, we are making plural. That's all. Okay? Okay, Sister Naima. Uh huh. Okay. The merchant, he went to the market. Now, atujaru, zahabu khalas. It is so easy. I am just wondering why you are a little confused. Okay, brother, we change our strategy now. Okay, ready? 
Only two, there are three words. We won't do too much. Conjugate with me. Zahaba, Zahaba, Zahabu, Zahabat, Zahabata, Zahabna. Jalasa, Jalasa, Jalasu, Jalasat, Jalasata, Jalasna. Kharaja, Kharaja, Kharaju, Kharajat, Kharajata, Kharajna. Okay. Atalibu, Zahaba. What did I say? Atalibu, Zahaba. Muhammadun, Hamidun, Atalibu, Atullabu, Zahabu. Because now it is more. Huh? Are you with me? That's all you have to think. So from <coughs> next week, I won't say whom, I will just say the proper plural. Huh? Okay, Zahaba. Al Waladu, Zahaba. Al Auladu, Zahabu. What will you say? Zahabu. Sahih? Al Auladu, Zahabu. Okay? Okay. And then, At Tajiru, Zahaba. At Tujaru, Zahabu. Because now talking about more people. Okay? Instead of Hua and Whom, now we are going to use the noun. Okay? Next one, Kharaja. Okay? Muhammadun? Al Mudarisu? Al Mudarisuna? Kharaja. Are you with me? Fine. Now, then again is Zahaba, At Tajiru, Zahaba, At Tujaru, Zahabu. Okay? 